For those unaware, stop loss is designed to allow you to pick how much you're willing to risk with your trade, while a take profit is pretty much the exact opposite. It allows you to set how much you're willing to make as a profit with one trade and close it once you are happy with the amount. But let's see how they work in action. There are quite a few ways to place a stop loss or take profit. Since we have activated one-click trading, the pop-up window will not open if we click the buy or sell button in the chart. So click the new order on the toolbar above or any other options from the one we described besides using the buy and sell buttons on the chart. You can then select stop loss and take profit from here. You can use the arrows or you can delete and manually add the price. You can do exactly the same with the take profit. Once you are done, click buy or sell. Now you can see on the terminal window the prices of your stop loss and take profit. Additionally, you will see inside the chart the two red spaced lines which indicate your stop loss and take profit price points. To modify those points, you can either do it through the terminal window, right click on the order, modify or delete, and on the pop-up window, you can edit the price or an alternative way is to click and drag the lines inside the chart. To do that, move your pointer to the line until you see the two-sided arrow and drag it based on the direction you will like. The price will be seen below on the terminal stop loss and take profit window as well. Another way to set up a stop loss or take profit and that can happen on an existing order is by moving your mouse pointer to the order line. Click and drag, similar to what we did earlier, but this time, since there was no stop loss or take profit limit set, we will be creating them from scratch. Trailing stop is one of the most important functions offered by the MT4 platform. It is quite popular among Forex traders as it helps them securing profits or minimizing losses. For those unfamiliar with the term, trailing stop is designed to protect against by enabling a trade to remain open and continue to profit as long as the price is moving in the investor's favor. For example, for every 10 points that the price moves up, the trailing stop would also move up 10 points. If the price moves up 30 points, the stop loss will also move up 30 points. But if the price starts to fall, the stop loss doesn't move from the last place and the order will be executed at that price. Now let's see how this works in action so you can better understand it. To note here that you can put a trailing stop on an open or pending order, but both types needs to appear on your terminal window first. So head there, right click in it, scroll to trailing stop and pick the level of risk or better say that the points you feel comfortable risking. I have picked 40 points. What that means is that as long as the order moves in my favor, this order was a sell order by the way, so as long as the price decreases, so do my stop loss which you can always check on the terminal window below. Until my order is in profit, the trailing stop loss function will not appear, but once it turns profitable and gains a few points, it will. Currently the order I have placed is on the low, but the trailing stop was set and as you can see a small t-symbol on the symbol area of the terminal window appears. That way you can always be in control of how much you will risk, but above all, if the market continues to be in your favor, you are securing profits. Thank you for watching our video on MT4. Please like and subscribe. If you want to learn more about the MT4 platform, check our channel for specific videos or watch our full how-to videos that explain in detail how to use and customize your MT4 for both desktop and phone application.